Hello everyone, this is David Nguyen from Eyebrows Academy. Alright, in this video I will show you um, one uh, new unconventional technique that I just thought about and I just try to uh, uh, record it, make a short video and show you how to do it. Um, the problem we try to solve is a lot of people um, you know, have difficulty uh, doing the upper strokes right the upper strokes sometimes like too curvy going down too fast and you know and a, mo a lot of time the upper strokes are across the lower strokes um, um, so it looks really bad so i just think about something uh, and then i try to to put it down here on on paper here to show you on paper and then i will show you how to do it on latex skin so this one this video we just try to address the uh, the upper stroke issues okay so suppose uh, we have a browse like that, as you can see right here. I have a browse, okay. So I'm going to do some um, uh, some strokes, okay. So let's get started. The first one is on the line, okay. First one on the line. Just normally we do on the line one, right. Two, I do all the way to the top like that. So one, two, three. Or you can do any um, head stroke the way you want, but this is uh, just for demonstration purpose. I just do the basic style. Okay, just like that. So we have the head stroke like that. One, two, three, four, five. Right. All right. So now I'm going to make the um, the first lower stroke, and then we will draw the spy. Okay. We start here, as you can see here. Now I'm going to do one okay so now i draw the spy and this one is spy six okay so here number six here number six right here number two here number three over there one two three i forgot your number number one right here and then four right here and five right by right here right so we have one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, as you can see, all we did so far is the head stroke and then the first lower stroke, which are the spy. And this is spy six. Okay. So after we make spy six, we just go ahead and do the lower stroke. Yeah, like we normally do. Right. Keep going. Lower stroke. Lower stroke. Okay, bear with me because I'm holding my left hand. I'm holding the camera and my right hand is drawing on this board right here. Okay. Alright, let's just keep going. We keep falling and falling and now we need to fall a little bit faster because we're getting to point number six right there. Last one on the line. Okay. So as you can see we make those and now we need to go back and do the refill. Okay. Okay, I'm going to get this one here. Let's do it in green, okay? So let's do the refill. Okay, refill one. Make sure you touching, you see, touching the, the tip right here and then go on to the spa, okay? Touching and go. Touching and go, right? Touching here and then go on to the spa, just like that. Can everyone see? Okay, let's just keep going. Okay, we're almost done with the refill. Right. Right. So that's what we have for the lower strokes, right? So now the main purpose of this video is about the upper stroke, right? So uh, normally we treat, you know, we work on this gap right here and then the upper stroke start maybe around here. We go down to the spine. But in this one, you see the problem is a lot of people do the upper strokes and then, you know, just crossing. Some do the upper stroke like this. Suppose we have the spine like this. Right. Lower stroke, lower stroke. And then a lot of you have difficulty making upper stroke and sometimes you do too curvy, right? Or sometimes I go too long, 
you see too long and then curve down like that and a lot of I saw a lot of you crossing the spine right here and you make like crossing you see crossing here like that not that's very bad yeah so the issue right here is that how do we know how fast we should go down or what angle we should go down and how long the stroke might be so I saw a lot of upper strokes problem out there a lot of upper strokes so in this video I just think about a way for you to practice okay uh, at least on paper and on latex skin first so that you can understand the concept and when you are good at it you can get the better on the uh, real human skins okay so now what I'm going to do is I will let's continue here you see right here so I will make another stroke here okay you see the gap right here so what I'm going to do I will make another stroke right here you see that okay and with this stroke I draw another spy and this one is going all the way to number three going all the way to number three over there can you see so now we end up with two spy right <coughs> excuse me the first spy we go all the way from here to number six and for here we make another stroke right here and then we make another spy going all the way to number three you see the second spy right here going all the way to number three right there okay so why am i doing that because i'm going to make the first set of upper strokes okay let's do the first set of upper stroke okay let's start right here okay just for demonstration purpose i just start right here first okay going down touching the spine okay just like that merge onto the spine keep going okay you see the spine right here i just touch the spine and then go down you see touch it and then go down okay touch the spine and then go down so touch the spine 3 and go down to spine 6 spine 3 down to spine 6 okay and now we pass spine 6 so we go here just keep going you see that okay as you can see we will deal with this gap later as you can see here this is the first set of the upper strokes okay so now i'm going to do another set of upper strokes okay right here okay so everyone ready all right and i'm going to use black okay let's not use black Let's use something else. Bear with me just a second. Okay, I'm going to use. Um, I think let's use blue. Okay. So, as you can see here, just recap, we did the lower stroke using spy six right here, right? And then we make another stroke here, the pink one here, and then we do spy three. So, we make the first set of upper stroke touching spy 3 and go down to spy 6 and go all the way down there okay now we do the regular upper stroke here okay okay so it's not right here going down and you see I touching I touching the purple one right there okay next one marching right here okay and I, there's some gap right here I can start right here and then touching right there okay let's just keep going so that's the first upper stroke you see the first upper stroke with it right there yeah now next one close and then I touch this one right here you see that I touch the purple one right there next one merging into there next set I would shoot right there okay would end up right there next one and up right here you see some gap right here just do some merging one okay next one 
start close right here but not touching the blue one and I should end up maybe around here or there okay how about end up right there okay this one close you see okay the paper is not flat enough come on okay merging go down just like that okay so as you can see I have two set of upper strokes there so it doesn't look that bad okay I just show you the concept okay and then we can improve when we work on the latex scheme and you see there's some gap right here this one is not that hard to do what we can do we can extend this one up here a little bit you see extend it down here okay and now it cover that gap right here okay and here we can extend the stroke here now it should cover it okay 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 some gap here just do some merging right there and it completely merge okay so we are done on the so this is how we do both spies yeah spy six and spy three this is just to help you with the upper strokes yeah okay so you understand the concept let's be recap so i make the first up uh, head strokes and then we did spy six here for the lower stroke area we did the lower stroke and then we did spy three all the way there and then we did the first upper stroke in purple and then when the upper stroke is done we did the last upper stroke here in blue okay well it doesn't look that bad right okay so this is the video on uh, paper so i'm going to show you on the latex skin how you do it on latex skin uh, my hope is that you will watch this video and then uh, you will be able to improve your upper strokes okay well thank you so much for watching again this is david nguyen from eyebrows academy thank you and goodbye